Good morning everybody, back with another video and today we are working on harvesting corn. And uh, the other thing that we're doing is picking the uh, purple potted pole beans. I wanted to show you, these are, these are nice, I like these purple potted because they, they just jump right out at you, you don't have to search to find the, uh, <clears throat> the beans because they're such a contrast in color. And uh, let's take a look. You going through there? Look, they just stand out like a sore thumb. I've got other areas where I have the green uh, beans, or <clears throat> Missouri Wonder and Kentucky Wonder pole beans, and look, look at the purple potted. They just they just stand right out. So they're real easy to pick. So if uh, if you guys are thinking about a three sisters garden and uh, want to want to put the beans in with your corn. Uh, you might want to think about trying to purple pot it. And uh, also, a uh, conversation piece, because we took them to a cookout last night. We took some corn and some beans with us. And uh, they, everybody was like, wow, purple beans. And, you know, hardly ever anybody's ever seen them. And uh, when you cook them, uh, they, they turn green, just like uh, if they were a green bean. So it's kind of neat how they, uh, how they change color right after you cook them. But uh, anyway, so... Uh, we've, I've, I started this yesterday picking the corn, and here's what I've got so far. Quite a bit of corn here, and uh, the ears, some of them are, are kind of small, some of them are, are pretty decent, but uh, not quite as much as I, uh, I think I would have hoped for, but there's still going to be plenty of corn there. And I'm only half done picking, so this thing will be heaping full when I'm done. And I'm only doing the sweet corn on the double standard because the uh, the other corn, the uh, what is it, the golden bantam, isn't quite ready yet. So let me uh, walk over there. Oop, look at that. There's a there's a bean. I missed a couple beans. Oh, you know why? Because I I picked this way. I may have started too early in the morning because the leaves are still a little dewy. But uh, let's go ahead and see. Here's some more beans. Uh, see if we can find a bean on here. Doo, 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 doo. Well, this is the golden bantam corn, and uh, you can see where it's just starting to. turn brown as far as that uh, silk is concerned. Uh, see, I don't see any beans, but they don't jump out. See, there's a... Oh, there they are. There. See how hard those things are to find? They look... They're the same color. So even when they're big, they're going to be a little difficult to find. So that's uh, that's one of the things I was I wanted to show you was the contrasting color between those purple potted pole beans and the corn. I thought that was pretty neat. Oh, here's a couple of beans right there. Looks like that one's been growing for a while. Here's another one. I think these might be Missouri Wonders. Or they might be a something or other 42. I can't remember. I'll have to look at my... Uh, I think these are the 42 ones. Man, those are huge. But anyway... <clears throat> All right, well, uh, I've got one more thing to show you, and then I'm going to get to picking. Um, I don't know if the sun's going to be an issue, but check this out. Okay, here's the height of the corn. This is the double standard corn, okay? I'm, this camera is right at my, you know, we'll say eye level. So um, this, this corn is, ranges from five to six feet. You move over here, and this... Uh, Golden Bantam uh, ranges from, uh, we'll say, 7 to 8 feet in height. And even taller than that <clears throat> is some of that, uh, some of that uh, popcorn. But that's about 8 feet tall. But now check this out. See those? That's the sorghum. And let me get up next to it. <clears throat> These are awesome. This, uh, this is the broom corn sorghum, and I'm standing, and I can reach 
eight feet high and it's two feet above that so these are ten feet tall you can see what it looks like how you can see this would be a broom and lash them together so this is pretty cool I can't wait till I can get to uh, harvesting this and down here a little further here we go this is the uh, Mennonite sorghum and it's just starting to grain out on top quite the uh, height difference see I can reach the top of this one I could probably almost reach the top of that one too but uh, see the height difference amazing all right well uh oh got something on the lens <coughs> anyway uh, I wanted to show you what we we're up to today picking some corn uh, today this afternoon or, or later this morning we're going to be uh, blanching and freezing the corn I'll take a couple videos of that uh, hope to see you there thanks a lot for watching we'll see you guys on the next video